I make to order on Binance whereby I sell out my liquidity which is I sold out my BTC for my USDT and also the one below it I sold my USDT for BTC so in this video I'm going to be showing you what this maker trade means and also what the taker trade also means and also I'm going to be walking you through the advantage and the disadvantage of using this two term which is a role of a trader in the market but before we jump start, my name is Tolani Ola and welcome to my YouTube channel. Here on this channel, I give a lot of helpful tips such as investment tips and also provide you with quality tech video to help you make better buying decisions when you are out there to get new devices. So if you're new to my channel and you want to learn more about this, then be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell on and also give this video likes if you actually get more value from it. So now we are now in the Binance app. So first of all, let's talk about Maker. In the cryptocurrency world, a maker is a, a is a trader that provide a liquidity to exchange, whereby allowing the trader to create a market for that token. So, what does this mean? Let's say you want to sell. Uh, let's say you want to exchange or you want to sell your liquidity. You know, you want to come down to this trade button right here. It's gonna bring you to this aspect right here. So what you want to do on this dashboard to make you a maker trade which will earn profit is that whenever you want to sell or whenever you want to exchange your liquidity for other token or other USDT or USDC, what will differentiate you from a taker trade and a maker trade is that whenever you set a, a limit of your trade which will lead your trade into other book. As you can see right now on this platform, what you want to do on this platform right here that is going to be initiating your trade as a maker trade which is going to be earning you more profit compared to take a trade which is going to be losing more of its money. So I'm going to be explaining how this will happen. As you can see right here, I can change from sell to buy and also I can change which of these tokens I want to exchange or I want to sell. As you can see right now, when I come to the buy, and as you can see, BTC is around 36,938.8. Then the point is very likewise the actual after the decimal also change. So let me say I want to, and I, I let me say I have a uh, USDT right here. As you can see, let me say I have like 10 USDT. So I want to use the USDT to get a uh, BTC. As you can see as the exchange is from btc splash usdt whichever one you have in your spot wallet instantly the system would pick it up and, uh, and help you out to make this happen so whenever you set uh, a limit for your uh for your order this will allow this trade to be initiated as a maker trade it's because you are setting a limit order which whether is a, a stop order or a limit order let me just use this as an example. When I click on limit order, as you can see, Bitcoin is around 36,949 point because it's a volatile coin, not a stable coin. So it's keep on increasing. So for you to become a maker trade, to make more profit, you don't want to buy cryptocurrency when it is high. You want to buy it when it is low so you can make profit when you are selling it out. So I'm going to be coming down right here and change this one right here to 5. As you can see and remember i've set a limit order what this means is that whenever bitcoin drop down to 35 right now is on 36 9 30 40 as it's changed is a volatile so whenever this uh bitcoin drop down to 35 936.61 immediately i want this trade to be initiated whereby binance is going to take order of this you don't have to be there again you can just go and sleep binance is gonna be taking care of this for you immediately bitcoin drop to this 35936.61 you set binance is gonna be initiating this trade and whenever you click on and you set your uh the total usdt you can set the minimum maybe you want to set uh about 10 10 usdt it's gonna be getting you it's gonna be buying bitcoin at this rate for you 0 0.000 to seven at this your set price limit 
as you can see so you can buy as many using your sport wallet so let me just say i want to buy although i didn't have my phone on my sport wallet that is why it's not showing right here i have my my phone on my i have my money on the phone wallet which i can't use it to be trade unless i transfer them right to the sport wallet which i'm going to be making video about if you are interested then be sure to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss that also i'm going to be explaining the advantage of you using the spot and this disadvantage of the fund wallet so as you can see let's say i want to buy the 10 at this rate so I, i'm going to be clicking on buy as you can see the insufficient fund because i have my phone in the fund wallet and you can't trade with a phone in the fund wallet unless you transfer it into the spot wallet so let's say you initiate this immediately you're gonna be seeing open order right here you're gonna see an order is gonna be coming is order is gonna be showing right here it's gonna tell you that you have placed an order so you don't have to wait there to watch bitcoin drop into this your set limit I mean, all you have to do is just to close the app or you do something else on the app so immediately bitcoin drop down to this it's gonna initiate this so as a maker you're gonna be making a profit from this immediately bitcoin drop to this you're gonna be getting bitcoin at a very cheaper rate compared to people that are buying it right now in the market order so this are advantage of a maker trade so you want to make a profit by buying bitcoin when it is low and sell it when it is high i know some of you might be asking question that what happened if bitcoin doesn't drop to 35936.61 if bitcoin doesn't drop to this uh your set limit the order is not going to be initiated your phone will be immediately back into your into your spot wallet so you're not you are not going to be losing anything but immediately bitcoin drop to 35 to 3596.1 which is your set limit a uh, binance is going to be removing uh, a fee which is very low compared to other exchange platforms so that is that for the maker trade so now on the other side what are takers a taker is someone removing his liquidity by fulfilling an open order on the exchange market so what does this mean let's say you want to convert uh, uh your cryptocurrency or you want to sell it out as you can see a lot of us make mistake in this aspect right here we mistakenly take the we mistakenly use uh, a taker trade for conversion mode because you are losing out when you when you go down to the trade and initiate your trade which is going to be initiated as a take a trade which you're gonna be losing on the trade but some of us want to only exchange our token so you don't have to come down to this particular place if you want to convert but if you want to trade this is where you come as you can see you're on the trade tab so if you want to convert this is where you convert any of your token this place this particular place you come down to this and click on convert this particular place does not have any charges is gonna charge you for converting it's as zero fee of converting so if you have been getting value from this video so far please be sure to give this video likes because this will help this video to rank on youtube because this is how youtube system actually works to rank video and for those of you guys that want to ask question leave a question down below in the comment section i will be down there to read and reply to each and every one of you guys and i want to say this for you guys if you want to convert your crypto and know that you are selling for fund you only want to convert it from one token to another this will really help because binance is not charging for fee of conversion but they are charging fee which is little which is little but the advantage is that whenever you want to convert if you use this platform you might lose your crypto value in exchange because you want to set it to the market order you are buying at the particular order of whichever token you are selling it out for but if you want to convert just make sure you come down to this just scroll at this top as you can see convert click on it and then you're going to be exchanging whichever token and the amount you can just change whichever one you want to exchange out as you can see you can change and set the the uh, the amount and the quantity and just preview order and confirm that it's going to be appearing into your world into your spot wallet so we'll come to the end of this video please be sure to give this video likes and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video peace and bye crypto family